Day four of voting for a House Speaker, and as of right now, the fight is not over, but Kevin McCarthy has made some progress. 15 of the 20 Republicans voting against him supported him during today's votes. However, McCarthy still needs a few more voters to change their mind before becoming the new House Speaker. Right now, the House is on a break until 9 o'clock tonight. If a speaker is not selected this evening, they will regroup on Monday and resume voting. Again, nothing can happen in the House, including the swearing in of new members like Alabama Representative Dale Strong, until a speaker is chosen. I'm ready to start voting on eliminating 87,000 IRS agents, which should be the first vote. You start looking at what we uh, need to do. I'm open to amending that to adding uh, 25,000 more Border Patrol agents. But those are the things that I was hoping that we would already be dealing with. As Congressman-elect Strong weighing in today on that ongoing speaker stalemate and what he wants to get to work on. And as you heard, he's ready to get to work in the House, but he says the progress in negotiating for the speaker vote has been positive. News 19's Emily Forrester joining us now live in the studio with more on what Congressman-elect Strong says things are doing at the Capitol. Yeah, Republican Congressman-elect Dale Strong says contrary to popular belief, as vote after vote continues to fail, the GOP is making progress. Now, the words he used, Republicans are lockstep with a little differing of opinion. He says he believes the current House rules package they're negotiating on will benefit America and will address issues people heard on the campaign trail. He says this process is hour by hour, and he does say he wishes they had already been at this point of progress earlier in the week, but Strong says it's going to take compromise to do what he believes is best for the country. I'm a freshman. I'm energized. I like where we are today, and I'm ready to start doing the business of America. And whatever we've got to do to get to that, it's not about the speaker. It's about America, and uh, that, that's what we're working toward. And I think the people understand uh, where we're going with it. They're frustrated, just like many of us are. And the congressman-elect says the sooner they get to work, the better it is for our country. At this point, Strong says he's ready to get to work. Some things he mentioned working on, some you heard earlier, include eliminating thousands of IRS agents, adding thousands of Border Patrol agents, and tackling the fentanyl pro problem. And we'll keep you updated on the speaker votes throughout the evening right here on News 19.